Now to the latest developments in the fight over Twitter. Elon Musk is now officially trying to back out of the $44 billion deal, but that has a social media company threatening a big legal fight. Reporter Sarah Donchi explains the new twists and turns in this saga. Elon Musk wants out of his drama-filled bid to buy Twitter, and the company isn't happy about it. In a letter addressed to Twitter at its San Francisco headquarters, Musk's lawyer wrote that Twitter made false and misleading representations and noted that Musk would be ending the deal. Twitter's chairman, Brett Taylor, fired off a warning shot to Musk on his own platform, writing, quote, The Twitter board is committed to closing the transaction on the price and terms agreed upon with Mr. Musk and plans to pursue legal action to enforce the merger agreement. We are confident we will prevail. Twitter can bring him to court to try and force the deal, saying, look, he has spent the last few months criticizing our executives, questioning the fundamentals of our business, criticizing everything we do. And they could argue that before they can't return to being the business that they were before he showed up. Musk expressed doubts about the deal back on June 21st during an economic forum. Well, there, there are still um, a few unresolved matters. Uh, you've, you've probably read about the, the question as to whether the number of um, fake and spam users on the system is less than 5% as Twitter claims, um, which I think is probably not most people's experience uh, on when using Twitter. Um, so we're still awaiting resolution on that matter, um, and that, that is uh, a very significant matter. No matter what happens in court, some believe that Twitter may have already taken a major hit. In fact, the company's shares were down 6% late Friday, while Musk's Tesla gained ground. No matter what, whatever Twitter is at the end of this process is going to be a very fundamentally different thing. And it may not be able to survive this whole process. Musk is the richest man in the world, but this move is going to cost him no matter what happens with any potential lawsuit. He's already agreed to pay $1 billion if, in fact, he backs out of the deal. I'm Sarah Donchi.